Hello, I can barely read any text from here. I am waving to you guys. I'm just not in proximity to wave, to touch my phone right now and actually wave. So, hi. I'm guest host for tonight. Does anyone else join? Awesome. Okay, wait, hold on. Is it gonna... Oh, I can't reach. Okay, wait, hold up. I need to like... There we go. Oh, wow. Yes, Oscar, I am in a suit and tie. Because why not? Actually, no. So there's like this TikTok guy who... Okay, oven's preheated. Uh, there's a TikTok guy who like makes recipes for his roommate. I don't believe they're actually roommates. And he's always like dressed up, but he wears an apron and I don't have an apron. So I'm wearing a jacket. Uh, welcome everyone to the live on Switch Grocery. Um, today we're making a chocolate coffee cake, which is exciting. Um, I'm Amer or Baby Cuz on Switch. So yeah, okay, I'm hoping I don't think it's scrolling down automatically. Oh, I know it is. Okay, great. Hi, Lisa. How you doing? There's like so many cameras here. This is a lot. I don't know how Neha does this so often. Okay, so uh, we're gonna be starting. So this recipe is available on the Switch Grocery website and blog, created by Oscar or I Hack Diabetes, who is also in. Hello, Facebook user. It doesn't show your name. I'm so sorry. Um, but yes, Oscar made this recipe, and my only job today is to not screw it up. So we're about to find out. Um, I forgot the eggs. So, okay. All right, got the eggs. And ingredients. Neha is here. She's on the live. Thank you, Neha. <laughs> so let me quickly go over the recipe of stuff you're gonna need to make this low carb coffee chocolate cake. Um, and it shouldn't take too long. I think it's only gonna take about 30 minutes. So let's go. Um, so what we got here. So half a cup of heavy cream. Uh, now this is 35% and according to Google, Heavy cream is 36% or above, but I couldn't find it at Walmart, so we're gonna make do. Um, we got Coco Polo uh, milk, choc milk cacao mini chips. So they kind of look like this. Oh my God, I dropped one on my laptop, that's fine. Kind of like that. I totally have not been snacking on these before the show. No. <laughs> No, actually, really good. Um, we got the Coco Polo hazelnut chocolate bar, which is going to be used to make the icing on top. Goodies chocolate snack cake. Uh, and then the keto chow chocolate. So we're going to mix all those in. Then we got coconut oil. I didn't know they sell liquid coconut oil. I straight up so dapper yes thank you um yeah i didn't realize they made liquid coconut oil and frankly i'm just lazy and i want the easiest thing possible so thank you great value and then we got the espresso powder cocoa powder heavy cream and eggs i don't know if i'm missing anything oh and coffee the most important part okay i got the recipe on my ipad so first step do 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 Okay. Who else? <laughs> awesome. So the first step is to preheat the oven. My oven takes about a million years, so I've already preheated it. It's good to go. Um, and then I got the baking pan ready to go as well. I don't have parchment paper. Sorry. But ideally, if you have parchment paper, definitely use it. That'll probably be a lot better. So hopefully, you know, Betty Crocker doesn't let us down. Fingers crossed. Uh, and then to add all the wet ingredients, First, so that's gonna be our three eggs, coconut oil, vanilla, oh, vanilla. There's the vanilla. 
and coffee. Okay, great. So let me crack the three eggs. Wow, so many people. Hello, everyone. So just while I'm adding this stuff, I guess if there's anyone on the live who joined in today and wondering why there's a guy in a suit rather than Neha, um, I am Neha's baby cousin. I have kind of been, oh, wait, we have more phones here. Ah, close. Sorry, um, I am Neha's baby cousin. I've been helping out with Switch a little bit since the first launch. And recently I've just been, happened to be at Neha's place and kind of join in in these live shows. And it's been really fun. So her and I have been doing a little bit of live shows here and there. And today while she is gone, I am hosting. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I am wearing jeans though. I gotta admit, I was too lazy to commit to the pants and I'm wearing socks and I'm not wearing any shoes. Um, although it's boiling right now in my kitchen. I want to like, I'm dying, um, but it's okay. Okay, I might be going too slow. I I'm sorry if I'm speaking fast. I'm a little bit nervous. I really don't want to mess this up. Coconut oil, how much coconut oil in there? Mm, one fourth cup of coconut oil. I have a one fourth cup here somewhere. Where did I keep it? I just had it. I swear I just had it. Oh, let me just turn this down. Are you going to strip for us? Uh, Oscar, unless there is a tip. Oh, there's my one cup. Uh, no, you can pay me for that. I'll send you my e-transfer. That's fine with me. But yeah, I, I haven't started my OnlyFans, so sorry about that. Okay, one fourth cup of coconut oil. That's a lot. Okay. There we are. One tisp of vanilla extract. Oscar should join the live. He should be here. I don't know. Oscar, where are you at? Okay, I spilled some in, so I'm gonna like, there we go. That should be fine. Okay. <laughs> and the coffee. Uh, I actually just found this out for anyone who has like an espresso original machine. If you just do a lungo shot of coffee, that's the perfect amount for this recipe. So it's kind of helpful. And I made this about 30 minutes ago, so it is cool down. Apparently you do need to use cool down coffee, no hot coffee. Even though I want to drink this right now, I should make a cup of coffee, but it's fine. I'll have water, whatever, healthy. I'm honestly so dehydrated most of the time anyway. Where's my whisk? Why is it that every time I need something, it's, oh, there's my desk. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so we're just gonna mix that in. Move the laptop under the phone camera that way. Okay, that's actually a good suggestion. Thank you, Nick. Oh. Okay, there we go. Yo, where's Gordon Ramsay? Like, he should be here. What's your baking experience? <laughs> um, like, back in high school, I used to bake a lot. And 
My favorite thing I used to bake are red velvet cheesecake brownies. Um, but it's been years, like when I entered university, I just completely stopped. I barely baked. I didn't do anything. So any recent baking experiences has been with Switch. Um, and I need to get back into it. I need to reclaim my, I need to make my high school self proud. But so far this is combined, which is fantastic. That is good to go. So then the next thing is to add the dry ingredients to the mix mix, blah, 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 which is espresso powder. So one tablespoon of espresso powder. I've already measured it out. I really wish I had like really pretty aesthetic bowls, but I don't. I feel like we need background music. That's a good point. What kind of background music? Hey, Google. Play Disney Jazz. Playing the album Jazz Loves Disney on Spotify. Is it gonna work? Okay, hopefully these songs don't suck. <laughs> okay, yeah, so sorry. <laughs> One tablespoon of espresso powder is going in. One tablespoon of cocoa powder is also going to go in. No, just kidding. Oh my god, this jazz. Is it like French? French? French music? I don't know any songs. Give me a suggestion. Also, I hope like the music's not... Lower it a bit. Lower what a bit? Okay. Lower the music a bit, sorry. This is Michael Bublé. It sounds like Michael Bublé. Okay, anyway, back to. I mean, it actually goes. <laughs> it's perfect. There we go. Uh, do, 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 do. Cocoa powder, espresso. Keto Chow Chocolate, so that's this one here. Okay. So one full packet, apparently. My mom's now joining behind the camera and just making me a lot more nervous, so that's great. <laughs> As if I wasn't sweating enough. I like that you're cooking me a soup. Right? I thought it was a nice addition. <laughs> I've shown you that, like, really cool guy in TikTok, haven't I? Yes. Yeah. Well, if you want me to mix these anything, I'm here to assist. No, no, I got it. Everyone loves a guy who can cook. Yeah, I, I, I need to learn how to cook. I, it's been bad. Oh wait, no, not this, not this. Okay, and then now we're gonna do the goodies chocolate, uh, chocolate snack cake. <laughs> Neha saying hi. Hi. Hi, Kishni. Hi, Aliyah. Use the whiskers of Mike to do some karaoke. Um, I might need a shot. <laughs> I could help you Getting a shot? Yeah. No, I'm good. Go for it. This is a. I got like. Oh my god, no! Wait, what? It's a mod of my ganache cupcakes. Oh, okay. Okay, and I believe that's all the dry ingredients for now. No, and the chocolate chips. No, no, saying cocoa powder, keto. Goodies. And a pinch of salt. Okay. You're talking really softly. Can everybody hear you? Yes, and I did not need your judgment from the line. I'm just asking. <laughs> Do you not exactly. I, I like I have a general idea of what ganache is. Oh yay. Okay. And then a pinch of salt, sulfate. 
I just have to mix this without making a huge damn mess because I really don't want to clean. Oh, it's combining like really easily. That's great. It's going to be the icing that you're making. This is actually combining really nicely. Wait, let me show you. I don't know if you guys can see that. Looks good, no? It mixed really fast. Yeah. Like, this is, like, very simple. And it looks like it's supposed to look, so I haven't screwed up yet. I've got a little bit of chocolate mix on my jacket, but that's okay. He needs to go to the dry cleaner anyway. <laughs> okay. That is done. That was like really fast. I was expecting a little bit more of a workout, but I'm not going to complain because Lord knows I need to work out again. I might remember what happens when you eat cocoa. Yeah. <laughs> so Neha's referring to a time where we were all working and I was snacking on some Coca Cola chocolate. All I'll say is like, pace yourself. They're really good, but pace yourself is, yeah. Why? Because it makes your stomach upset. <laughs> Thank you, mom. <laughs> Just randomly blurting out why. into a well-greased, yes, yeah, so I've greased the pan, so that's all good to go. And now we're just gonna pour it in. Okay, so let me bring the pan over here. Thank God we got a dishwasher. <gasps> Wait. No, I didn't forget the, okay, the heavy cream. Okay, yeah, I thought I forgot the heavy cream. No, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Mom, they're saying you're funny. Me? Yeah, you. Oh, yeah. Sometimes, some days. Every now and then. Every now and then. <laughs> okay, so that is good to go. So, can everyone I see like this? The chocolate. I bet rum would taste good in this recipe. <laughs> Probably, but. So what tastes good in this recipe? Is that the chocolate chips? All of it, yeah. So it's low carb, um, using keto chow and goodies. So it's completely low carb and yeah, it's a chocolate coffee cake. So nice combination of bitter and sweet. Where's coffee? Did you put coffee? I did put coffee and I put uh, instant espresso. Take, take the other spatula to scoop it up. Yeah. Let me just. Yeah, I'll, I'll clean it up. It's not the same. Oh no, but you're losing the, the good stuff. I lost one drop. Should we pay her a fee for using her kitchen? <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. it's fun. I'm waiting to eat the chocolate cake. That's her payment. Okay, that should be good. Scoop it, scoop it. Scoop, what? There's scoop. nothing to scoop. There is so much more to scoop. No. You, okay. Okay. No backseat cooking. Sorry. <laughs> That's great. Thank you. Okay, you want to lick the bowl? No. She says no. Come on, why not? That's like half the fun of baking. You're supposed to lick something. <laughs> what's the point? That's the point. It's got a raw egg. 
Oscar saying whisk it or lick it. Okay. Just for Oscar. Okay, here we'll lick this together. You just licked that, it's the same thing. It's really nice. It is, it's really nice. It's like a, it's essentially like a chocolate tiramisu. Yes, it is. I like the coffee taste in that. So. Yeah, the coffee yeah. taste. Okay, so that is done. Let me just show it to you. There we are. Okay, so that's gonna go in the oven for about 20 minutes or so. Okay. I don't know why I can't grab this right. There we go. Oh shoot, I forgot to take that out. Oh. Okay, put this. Hold on, yeah. Yeah, out of the way. I'm impressed you're baking in a suit. Honestly, <laughs> low key a bad idea because it's just really hot. Okay, there we go. Hey Google, set a timer for 20 minutes. Okay, there we go. Okay, so that is going well. All right, haven't fucked it up yet. This is an accomplishment in itself. Okay, now you have to preheat the oven. Why? Why would I have to preheat the oven again? It was already set for 325. No, 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 we, we made food earlier. It's, it's at 325, we're good. I just spilled water online. That's kind of embarrassing. Okay. Next for the ganache. Chop one Coca Cola milk bar into and place in a medium sized bowl. What are you making now? Icing. Oh, you're making icing? Yeah. Oh, that comes with icing and all. Mm -hmm. Can you lower when seeing ingredients? Yeah, sorry, I'm not very good at this. But <laughs> we're gonna use the uh, Coco Polo hazelnut chocolate bar here to help make the icing, which is this one here. And I need a chopping board. All right. Okay, I'm opening a chocolate bar. Okay. I am now throwing away the wrapper. Okay. <laughs> um. You have a question? Can you raise the laptop a little? I'll just push the screen back because you're tall. No, but it's not supposed to show me. It's supposed to show what I'm doing. Oh, it's supposed to show you a little too. Well, you can see I'm in a suit. Okay. But yeah, I can't get the whole thing. Okay. So we're gonna just chop this bar up now into shards, I guess. Wait, should I? It's fine. I should have like had a little small piece of this bar, but it's fine. We'll save it for the ganache. Also, like. <laughs> He's gonna warm it up with heavy cream and pour over chocolate. Yes. So I'm just jumping this up. Yeah. You would think I'd have better knife skills, but also like this chocolate's like literally melting so fast in my hand right now. I completely forgot Disney music was still playing. 
Apparently, they're making a live action of Moana. Eleven. Yeah, they're doing a live action of Moana. Brock is going to be back as Maui, but they haven't done casting yet for Moana herself. I was going to say, who's going to play Moana? I like her. My celebrity crush for the longest time was a girl who voiced Moana, so I would like for her to reprise her role. That's true. It was. Where, where, where was she from? Mexico. Hawaii. 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 I thought she was from Mexico. Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay, so chocolate's cut up now. No, the girl who voiced her. Hawaii. Hawaii. Huh. I've never seen ganache made. <laughs> Baby. Okay. Um, microwave the heavy cream for about 45 to 60 seconds, then pour over the top of the chocolate. Okay, so. This is going to be, well, going to move all the chocolate into this bowl here. Wow, that looks gourmet as hell. When's Gordon Ramsay going to give me my cooking show? Actually, Gordon Ramsay giving me a cooking show. It's just going to be him calling me a donut for about 80 minutes. Where's the cream? Oh, there. Okay, so we need half a cup of heavy cream, which we're gonna throw into the microwave. So unlike Neha's kitchen. Oh, there is there is half a cup. Half a cup. This there's, is half a cup. Oh, there's a quarter cup. Yeah, there is half a cup. Okay. So yeah, we have a microwave unlike Neha's kitchen. This seriously just broke. Like, what the, f <laughs> what the actual fuck? <laughs> no. no, I can take it off. You are live. I'm live, so what? So you. I can't swear. Mm -hmm. Neha gave me permission. <laughs> I always swear in her life. Mom, you do this. <laughs> I cannot. How would I have that luck? Like, that's just ridiculous. To give you some narration on what's going on, my mom's using her teeth in order to like take off that lid thing on the, f oh wow, she did it. Hopefully her dentist isn't watching. Moms know what to do. Yes. That's specifically part of the training of becoming a mom, learning how to bite things and open them. <laughs> it's in the parenting handbook. <laughs> First chapter of what to expect when you're expecting. <laughs> Just open it all. What's the old fashioned way? Okay, we're gonna heat this up in the microwave for 30 seconds. Okay, no, that's not bubble. Alright, so And then I'll just grab a spoon and mix it up. Is anyone here old enough to remember the milk cartoons where you don't have to pull the thing? Not me. Don't wait. Okay, got it. Okay, so Oscar's got me doing this really quickly here. So he says you have to like mix it instantly and vigorously. I'm not trying to ruin my stuff, so we're gonna like do it carefully and vigorously. Okay. Fork, fork. Okay, I'll switch, I'll switch. I just want to keep it moving. I'm going to Mom. Okay, fork, fork. Yeah, give me one sec. Okay, there we go. Yeah, it's melting. It's just the hazelnuts that are not, which makes sense. Faster, faster. How was that 45 seconds? Your recipe said 30 to 45 seconds. I did 30 seconds because it's a quick button on my microwave. <laughs> but it's melting, it's melting. <laughs> Q 
Okay. No, that's good. That's Do good. Keep, you to your room. keep stirring it. Keep stirring it. I am stirring it. It's melted. Okay, yeah, it is. It's good. Yeah, it's a hazelnut. I feel like once you hit your 20s, you have to send your parents to your room rather than the other way around. <laughs> But yeah, it's all melted, so now it's just the hazelnut kind of topping on it, which I think is just a fun little difference that we're, fun little change that we're doing up. So how does it become icing? I will get back to you on that. So that has completely melted and everything. Uh, now let me see. Then pour over the top. Wait, what? Okay, wait. Yeah, no, we're good. So yeah, it's all done. That's the icing? Yeah. It's not thick enough though. Can we make it take good? Just keep stirring and stirring. Okay. I don't know what movie this one's from. Oh my god, this actually looks so good. It will thicken as it cools. There you go, Mom. Okay. Thank you. Oscar, help me out. Should I stop stirring now? <laughs> it's looking so good. You could just microwave this and have it as hot chocolate. Just saying. Although it might cool before the cake is ready. Okay, wait, so should I stop stirring or no? <laughs> hey Google, how much time is left? Okay, eight more minutes. Eight minutes. Okay, I'm gonna stop stirring now because it's completely combined. <clears throat> okay, great. So that's all ready. And now we wait for the cake. Remove the cake from the oven and allow it to cool before removing from the pan. Top it off with chocolate icing and enjoy. So I probably won't remove it from the pan, <laughs> just because that's where I'm probably going to screw it up. And it's going to go, it's going to go to shit. So. Mm. I can try, though. I greased it pretty well. It'll end up being a, yeah. stir every 30 seconds or so, just as, so it doesn't get too firm. All right. Fuck, throw away the fork. Oh, you're cool. Sorry, Lisa, for activating your Google. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Do I really have to wait eight minutes? I don't have patience for this. And then also the Barbie movie trailer came out today, which was really weird. Did you see it? 
Yeah, they're making a Barbie movie with Ryan Gosling Barbie and movie. Margot Robbie. Yeah. And I don't know why. <laughs> I want to watch the trailer though. I may not watch the whole movie. Mm-hmm. How long did your Loblaws haul last you? Oh yeah, um, I got like four sandwiches out of my shopping. So during the Loblaws haul, I got a whole really nice loaf of bread, some really good cheese, bacon, and I think a Gatorade as well. That Gatorade was so crap. You don't have to wait, but it won't cook. By the way, don't remove the cake from the pan until it's completely cooled, otherwise it will fall apart, yeah. Um, what was I saying? Sorry, yeah, so from the Loblaws haul, like, it lasted me, I think, a good, like, four days, which is not too bad. But, yeah, that's pretty much... We need some bloopers, lol. I will definitely post some somewhere, I don't know, I'll record it for sure. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's pretty much how you make this chocolate coffee cake, it's just waiting in the oven, so we're not gonna wait too long on that. Um, I'll make sure to send Neha pictures of the completed product once it's done. And yeah, this icing is looking really good, just kind of stirring it every 30 seconds. But that's the recipe, guys. So far, did not mess it up, which is great. Oh, we're going to wait for the cake? Okay. Should be done soon. Yeah, it's got about five more minutes. Okay, we can talk about the Barbie movie. Well, Neha's asking what grocery store should we do next. See, I want to do Costco, but we don't have a Costco membership. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking Walmart. I feel like Walmart is a good one. Loki, I think it would be funny to do Whole Foods just because everything is apparently so expensive there. So I think that would be funny where we try and do a budget one of Whole Foods. And try to make something less of that. But I think Walmart for sure is going to be next. Because I feel like that's a very common one. And any extra money left over, I'll probably go like to the toy section. Maybe get something cool there. Fake farm boy. I was about to say, who faked a boy? Okay, farm boy. Farm boy is a good one as well. Yes. I've only been to farm boy once. Or twice. Highland Farms. They have lots of selection too. Yeah, Highland Farm is also good. There's just not a lot of Highland Farms around. No. Like, I only know the one in Mississauga. <clears throat> but they have, like, a huge selection. They have a huge selection. Superstore. Superstore is another good one. It's... I, I think that would be fun as well. Yeah. Yeah, there's so many grocery stores. We have to do Farm Boy. We have to do Whole Foods. We have to do Superstore. We have to do Costco. Where else can we go? We should also do St. Lawrence Farmer's Market. That's where Switch first launched. So I feel like that would be a really nice homage to go back to the farmer's market and then do a live from there. Maybe as like, that would be fun. So St. Lawrence, for anyone who don't know, that's where Neha first like presented uh, Switch Grocery to the public. She had her booth set up and everything and she had these nice banners and all and she was sampling oh, what was it the philosophy smoothie mix that was a really good nice day <laughs> i remember that and i remember somehow like i ended up behind the table and i was like talking to people about it and that was a really fun day that was good <laughs> Where else would be fun? I want to do. I want to do something completely obscure. But yeah, I feel like farmers markets could be like a really special episode, really fun idea. Is this Michael? I don't know if it's Michael Bublé. 
can you give us an update on what's going on with Nordstrom? So, <laughs> <laughs> um, Nordstrom is shutting down. Uh, and right now, like, what's the terror? Yeah, I've never been there, Oscar, so I, I'd be open to that. It would be a different challenge there. But, um, yeah, for context, I used to work at Nordstrom, and my last day was Saturday, so I no longer work there. But um, right now, it looks like the store will be closing down sometime in June, possibly earlier. There's no set date on to when it's going to close. Um, and, yeah, it's just going through liquidation sales. So whatever you buy there, it's at whatever discounted price. You just have to... It's with liquidation, things are going to be going. Is that where you got the suit? I got the, actually, no, none of these are from Nordstrom. <laughs> so this is from India. This is from my mom. And then this is from Amazon. That's, that's Brooks, Brothers. Brooks Brothers. So that's horrible advertising, but I don't work there anymore. So that's okay. Will there be bigger discounts coming? Most likely in the future. I see, I don't even work there anymore. So I can like really say a lot. And I mean, what are they going to do? So, um, yeah, there are going to be bigger discounts coming. It's just we don't know when. The only thing that will... Ooh, cake's done. Okay, shut up. Ah, no, no, no. Turn down the volume. Okay, wait. So, I have to test this cake. Um, I'll come back. <gasps> ah! Oh, it smells like a goddamn brown... Oh, wait, no, it is not done. It is still jelly. Okay, wait, we're gonna do another three minutes. Hey Google, set a timer for three minutes. For how many minutes? Three minutes, because Oscar said put it in for 20 to 23 minutes. So I'm gonna give it another three minutes. It's still a little bit like soft in the center. So we're gonna hold off there. Uh, sorry, yeah, bigger discounts will be coming. It's just gonna be periodically depending on the performance of the stores. Um, and then discounts at Nordstrom Rack locations versus Nordstrom locations, they could be different. Nothing's gonna be very consistent in that regard. The only thing that's gonna slowly go on discount is the beauty department. So anything makeup, fragrance related, that's gonna take a while before it goes on like a bigger sale. Um, but yeah, also got like everything is final sale. There, You can't return anything you buy. They're, like Nordstrom's no longer accepting returns. It's, that was like the, that was the most fun yet the most difficult thing to tell people, which was we can't accept returns. We no longer do that. That's not a thing that's possible. So just go in there bearing in mind. <laughs> Lisa, you have a three minute timer. <laughs> if I miss my timer, can you let me know? Thank you. Um, but yeah, with final sales, like it's, you get some of it, it's very hard to tell people, but yeah. Oh my God, Let It Go is playing. Um, but yeah, that's, that's the deal with Nordstrom. And then all Canadian locations are gonna close down for good. You'll have to go to the States if you wanna shop there. Mm. This live is sponsored by Nordstrom. They could barely pay me. They're not gonna sponsor a live. <laughs> So, I wish it was sponsored by Nordstrom. That would be fun. They actually, they had an e-bar there, which was some of the best pastries ever. Like, they had this Nordy bar. It was so good. I could not with it. And even their restaurants, like, they were really, really good. Honestly, I wish this was sponsored by Nordstrom. And they can give me a free soup. I will always be in a soup. I don't mind that. But, yeah, it was definitely awkward going to work every day wearing nothing Nordstrom. So, okay, I prefer the original Let It Go to this crap, but it's fine. Who would be fun? Like, we need Loblaws, we need Walmart to sponsor us, we need Costco to sponsor us, we need Superstore to sponsor us, and now we need Nordstrom to sponsor us, even though they're going out of business. The E-Bar Blood Orange. Yes! I was obsessed with that thing. That was like, at least twice a week going in, I needed something refreshing because it can get really warm in the store. The blood, ah, uh, I am so glad you said that. That actually made me so happy.
I love that thing. Okay. Lisa, I assume your timer went off as well. Yes, obsessed, right? Okay, let's see. It's still looking a bit soft. Wait, I gotta do the toothpick test. Where's my damn Oh, here. Do we have oven mitts? Yes, it's in the drawer underneath. No, I got it. Yeah, like you can still see here a little bit. It's like no, it's not done. It's not done. So we're gonna do that in for like another five minutes. No, I think you should put it for fifteen. It's too loose. Let's be in the middle ten. No, it. But I don't want it to burn. Cook it. It won't okay. burn. Hey Google, set a timer for fifteen minutes. So <laughs> fortunately, I don't think we'll have time on the live to get the cake out and decorate and everything. That's I do apologize there. Here I'm gonna just tilt this up here. Um, so I think I'm going to end the live here. Thank you all for kind of joining. I hope you had fun. I'm definitely going to send pictures and hopefully you guys can see the updated product once it's done. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. This was my little guest appearance. I hope I didn't do too bad. <laughs> and apparently I, this is sponsored by Nordstrom. So, you know, go there, shop the deals, whatever you can consider a deal. It's actually not that great, but maybe just wait a little bit. <laughs> I don't have to promote the store. But yeah. Hope everyone had a great time and I will catch you at another live time. Bye everyone. Love you. <laughs> yeah.